Victor Galvin. Yeah, 24-7 mindset. Yeah, 24-7 mindset. Let's go. 24-7 mindset. Somebody who's who's who says, okay, I'm ready to get into the room. Right? What are some things that 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 they should do to prepare themselves to be when when they're in the room? What are some questions they might want to ask? What are some um um key points they should you know really pay attention to? Like can you can you give any knowledge on 100%. that? 100%. So so number one, you, what you got in the room. Why? This yeah. is going to be a why. And yeah. that person that you went in the room with, right? Yeah. yeah. Is going to offer something. You just not identify this smart guy just because. You yeah. went because you saw something on this person and this person is crushing it. Yeah. When you start going into the room, you're not going to be stupid spending your money on, on, on things that doesn't make sense. Yeah. You finally take a step for you, for your life, for your family and everybody to be more successful. Mm -hmm. So listen to them and really ask them, where should I go from here? What, what would you recommend me? They're going to tell you. You need to sign to here, sign here, sign here, sign here. And I promise you, you'll be successful. I'll get you here. A lot of the people think, even though they're in a room with the right people, oh, let me cheat it. Let me just do this. I think I only need this. It takes, not one person, it takes a lot of people to create a good business. Same thing. Uh -huh. It takes a full circle of data from marketing from that, from process and systems and and peoples and whatever mm -hmm. it takes whole, everything so take a whole package and they'll be like you too you still too small you, you don't need this they're gonna tell you that and then you say I'm broke I don't got the money but I really need you to let me know when I need this and they're gonna prepare you they may say you know what let me give you a discount go all in and when you start making money you pay me back Mm. that's the type of rooms if, if it's a good room they're not going to tell you that man and just remember on this room where you get in these people did not put all these people together just mm -hmm. because they went through struggles they exit they make millions they got their jets they whatever they know how to do it so they're going to guide you the right way they do things to impact people, mm -hmm. to help people, because that's the only way that they can keep going up. Otherwise, they will not make it. They depend, based on, 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 on how well he's doing, his seminars, his, his room where you get in, mm -hmm. for you, they, you need to be successful before they can take it to the next step. The more people that talk good about this person, the more people that become successful from this, uh, from this person, the, 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 the higher position they're going to go in. Yeah. I told you a long time ago that in construction, big GCs help minorities. When the minority takes the job, beat against the main, the prime, and they take away the job from the prime, it's time for the system to say, okay, you help me grow somebody in life, now we're going to give you a bigger job, more profitable and everything. Mm -hmm. Same thing in that room. That person teaching you, he cannot go up if he's, if he's not pulling all these people, mm -hmm. if he's not growing all these people. And believe me, getting in the right room, you can grow 20 to 30% a year. Mm -hmm. Easy. It's crazy. Yeah. I know because I've seen it. Day and day and day, and we see financials. We see these people that come in with three million. They, they, they now they're doing twenty-seven million people. That was a twelve now doing thirty. People that was doing thirty now doing a hundred and something, and and it's it's just crazy. Mm -hmm. It's just crazy with a little bit of data how much it will change your mind with a little bit of of how you do things, how you say things, how you approach things. And and, 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 and and the confidence that gives on you. So 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 the first impression, that's what's going to get the customer to buy into you. Mm -hmm. That's what gives you the money for a little bit. Mm -hmm. Get in another fucking room, man. That's how much how much getting in the room helps people, getting, uh, help people and companies. Yeah. So how, how many people have you gotten in? How many people have you gotten to get into the room? The, the, in my room? 
Oh, in, no, 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 or, no, or, no, or, I haven't, no, I haven't, I've, I've been helping a lot of people, but, yeah. but they're not committed. I'm not charging them, but yeah. I still get them up to a level yeah. that I, I change their minds. I say back in some podcasts that people leave because they, they're like, wow, this, all this data, that means I can do this and they go ahead and do it. And then after they fail, they thought that they can do it, but I said, no, you got to stay consistent. Remember I said, yeah, yeah. you got to get in the room. You got to be disciplined. You got to stay consistent. You got to, all that. Yeah. You gotta have courage, boom, all in. Yeah. But 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 in the room that I'm in right now, I see that room moving transactions of trillions of dollars. I see that. Mm. And guess what? the transactions are going to be happening in the same room from the same people. It's not going to be outside people. You, you're going to be doing services and work and all that stuff through outside people, but the money is going to circulate in the room. Mm. It's not going to come out. So it's like a network in there. It's going to be like a network, like another little monster, like a little, like another little country that controls this portfolio of money. And then when they find out, somebody's going to come back and say, what the fuck are you guys doing? Now the big dogs, all the big ones, mm -hmm. they're going to say, hey, what, what happened here? It's too late. Mm. Now we control. It's right? not, so not only getting in the room is knowledge, but it also is a network and it can benefit your company. You might meet yeah. somebody that supply and demand. You supply this. This guy needs it. You met him in the room and he's, yeah. you know, he's, he's successful and he's going to make you successful because he needs to get the stuff that you have mm -hmm. to offer, to whatever it is that you're, you're offering. I have friends. Just <clears throat> waiting for you to start something that requires this type of uh, business or whatever for him to supply containers of your material. Mm. Live fixtures, uh, AC, AC uh, filters, whatever yeah. you need. Yeah. They can load you with, uh, with, 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 with Connex. Yeah, yeah. You got distributors that can distribute in the same room whatever you need for anywhere in the world. Yeah, yeah. The same people in that room controls yeah. everything. Yeah. I told you. Health, food, HVAC, roofing, um, construction, construction, <laughs> yeah. everything. Yeah, it, it, it's, 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 it's crazy. No, so that's good because that's that's something that people really need to know too. Is that you're going into a room and you know there's 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 people that are willing to help you in that room, not just knowledge wise, but business wise too. Like, hey, uh, what kind of business are you in? I do da 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 da. Well. That's perfect. That's kind of what we're into too. Is, is do, yeah, do, and do everybody help? help each other. Yeah, you everybody know? help each other. Even picking their brains. Even just sitting there, and be, hey man, I did this. Are, last are, you, year. Kid, are you kidding me? Yeah, it's yeah. not picking the brains. It's like, hey, th th this is what they say. Hey, you in the same business I'm in. I I, I need to sit down with you. Okay, no problem. And and not be, it's like I need this, this, this. Okay, this is how you do it. This is because of this, 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 and this. And, and you put it together. You give him the plan and the process and the system and all that stuff. What works. You don't have to pay for that. If you want to go into another market, if you're yeah. in commercial, you don't have to go into residential and struggle and fight and invest. There, there's already doing somebody residential that you can sit down and talk and he's going to give you all the data and he's going to send you all the folders, all the apps, everything, how he does it so you can go ahead and adapt it and may cost you a little bit of money but not enough like you was going to do it and, and now you can take over. Yeah, yeah. So you it's very you, easy. You don't have to go through trial and error. And, Somebody and, did that for you and then they, they gain the knowledge on what to do exactly in those moments. So why, why, should, why should you go through the same problems he went through when you can just ask the guy, hey, what did you do differently? I did this. Saved you time, saved you money. And 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 and, uh -uh. and the reason we think big is because our mentor, right? Yeah. Our mentor, my mentor, Brandon Dawson, helped me believe that I can go to big things. And 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 he helped me not just believe, he also have everything to support how to get there. Very easy. Yeah. We also teach him, he also learned from us. Yeah. How all these big words that we have and the quality and the support and the delivery and all that stuff that we adapt, that we used to do, now we know how to do it and we deliver, we take ownership owner, we take ownership and responsibility of our actions yeah. and all that stuff is because of him. Yeah. But he also learning from us. So we also teach him mm. because he's building a monster as he's building, he's, he's growing. And, and there's Always nothing learning. wrong. Always and, learning. And there's nothing wrong, believe me. This guy is the best. Mm -hmm. So I always 
But at one point, I'm like, why are we always talking about my man? No, I got to give him credit because he's the one that helped me. He's the one that listened to me. He's the one that created the monster. So at the same time, he's the, our mentor, but he's also learning from us how to readjust, how to keep going. We also mentoring him. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the beauty about getting in the room yeah. with people that really listen, people that really collecting the data, people that really have the data to give to you to take it to the next level. Yeah. What do you say to people that say, ah, I, don't, I don't think I need to go in the room. I don't, what, that, that room, I don't, I don't think there's anything I can learn from that room. What do you say to those people? Um, they're wrong. 100% they're wrong. Because, because what happens, they think they know what they don't know. Mm -hmm. And what they think they know is going to screw them. Yeah. So as soon as they get in their room and they bring this bad energy and all that stuff, we feel it. Yeah. We don't, we don't allow that, that freaking, that culture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if, if Brandon doesn't kick him out, we're going to kick him out. Yeah. Fuck this, mother. We don't need this yeah. uh, low belief and all that stuff yeah. around us. Yeah. Somehow yeah. we're going to make him be uncomfortable and get the fuck out. It's negative. Because really? we, we want to carry people. We want to help people. We want people to be in the same environment we are. Yeah, yeah. A hundred percent. Yeah, a lot of people have carry negativity with them. They don't, and so when positivity they hits them. They think they know it all. But when positivity finally hits them, they don't know how to handle it. They 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 stay in, in, a, in a negative state. And which was like, like you said, that, that means they're not growing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. To grow is to learn. To learn is to be positive. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You ever seen... <laughs> I'm going to use a Simpsons reference. But you know how, you know, you, do you know Flanders is his neighbor next door always like, hey, how's it going, Homer? Always happy. He goes to church mm -hmm. every day. He's always happy. Mm -hmm. And Homer's always like, man, this guy, see you later. Like, this guy's always happy. I can't be around this guy. Well, guess what? In this guy's world, he's positive, man. No, no, because... You, because, you, you look through life through his eyes. Yeah, he's yeah, happy. He and, feels like he has it all. And, and what there's happened, nothing wrong with that. What happens there... Is because he wants to do the same thing, but he cannot do it. He yeah. cannot be positive. He cannot be happy all the time. Yeah. So he's actually jealous yeah. of that person. Yeah. Which and that's is what happens. That's how life traits, is. Man. Yeah, I know. It's all negative, man. Yeah, it, 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 it's, 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 it's right or wrong. And, and right there is, 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 man, you just got to be positive and make it work. And yeah. from the bad, you can you can and give it a you chance. Can turn it, oh, no chance. You can learn from it. You well, can, well, well, I'm you saying can, for people, for people who say, no, you I can, don't think, oh, give you, it a chance. You can you can do what's wrong you can make it real yeah 100 percent. yeah yeah i really believe on that in these days yeah how we think you know like us as owners we're like oh we, we're not gonna do that we're like wh wh why not it's your business you make any call you are just you can change your business the way you want to do it. Nobody needs to come and tell you. Yep. If somebody say no, whatever, they're not on a line or whatever, just get them out. Yeah. Have them go and start their own business, run it their way. But what I'm saying is that's how, how on these ages, on this era right now in 2023, you do the business the way you want. Yeah. And that's what makes companies better. That's what makes companies different. That's what makes companies very successful. That's what makes company 100% to be on the radar. Yeah. You get a lot of attention from that. If you do it the old way, guess what? You're gonna get back behind. You're gonna, yeah. yeah. I um talk talk to somebody out there, man. Think th think of somebody out there that that is is like like we just said, man. It's just not believing, not doing anything. Tell that person right now how it is, man. I I can tell you, and and this happened to me yesterday. This person wanted to start a company, and I didn't really want to listen to him, but. I'm like, all right, do you really want to start this business? Mm -hmm. I'm like, this is what you need to do. So what I'm going is, I'm like, number one, you're building a company right now working for somebody mm -hmm. inside me. Yep. Right? So I tell them everything. I'm like, if you don't do this, which is you need a visionary, a door, and a manager in a business, and you don't have 200000 for for his type of business that he wanted to run, I'm like, forget it. A lot of people come with a lot of fucking dreams and a lot of stuff, and they're really not going to listen. They really don't go after the dreams. They really forget their dreams when pressure comes in. And I say, and I say, Kevin, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm like, what you're doing right now, building a company, working for Luis right now, is bad. I say, don't do that. But let me give you my honest opinion. Work your ass in that company. Help this guy out. 
after work, after 6 p.m., whatever you get out of work, do your meetings, start pushing your company, do whatever you got to do. Don't steal nothing from this guy. Don't steal their people. Set up your process assistance, your plans, and all that stuff. Get in the room, Saturdays and Sundays, schedule your meetings. And I say, I promise you, by April, March, you'll be ready. But you have to listen to three guys. He like, Victor, I ask you one simple question. Now you move my whole life. I feel like you changed my whole future. I see myself doing big things. I'm like, yeah, but you got to do a lot of little things that make sense. Mm-hmm. And he's like, so for those people, he's like, I'm going to do it. I'm like, I love it. But don't start the business until you add these processes. Mm -hmm. And I gave him the names. Mm -hmm. And I also, I said, you need to follow these three people. I said, you need to follow Grant Cardone, Brandon Dawson, and Victor Galvin. Mm -hmm. If you don't follow those, if they don't get you ready, in five months, you're not going to make it. And the reason I say that to follow me, because I'm obsessed. Mm -hmm. You got to make it work. If you can't make it work, at least you identify who out there can help you make it work, like me. Mm -hmm. If I cannot make it work, I'm going to find somebody Mm -hmm. that can help me take me to that level. And that somebody is either Grant or Brandon. Mm -hmm. And if he's smart and really listen, he doesn't have to pay a lot. He can come to me, and, 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 and if he's committed, mm-hmm. and if I push him, I tell him exactly how he needs to do it. Mm-hmm. He can make it. But part of that deal, he's still going to have to sign in with Brandon. He doesn't got all the fucking choices. I will mentor him, but he's still got to sign. Because the last thing I want to do, I want to take people from a good system that Brandon has, and I want to adapt my own system. I will never do that. What I'm saying is, he still got to go through those guys because... Maybe this guy, Kevin, is the next guy can help Brandon bring a company, a service company that can Brandon can um, take it public faster or whatever. I'm just saying, maybe this guy, Kevin, can pass me, and yeah. I don't care. Yeah. But that's the people that Brandon needs. That's why I always, before they commit to me, they have to commit to signing something to them. Yeah. Because Brandon is the goal guy. Yeah. So that's the message, guys. Get in the room for multiple reasons. When you got confusing in your life that you think that you want to go big, identify how big you want to go. Be clear on your vision and, and, and understand that you're going to have a lot, of, a lot of problems. Understand that you got a lot of steps in, 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 the, in the way. There's people out there that can help you take it to the next level. Brandon Dawson talks about breakpoints at every at three to five and then five to uh, nine or whatever. So, so, so there is a break point on what to do in your business, what type of leadership you need, what type of uh, uh, office, what type of everything you need in your system. I'm sorry, what type of process and systems and stuff like that you need and what type of leadership and, 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 and people in your organization that take you to the next level, guys. So, so make sure when you identify all that, go all in and don't look back. Because if you look back and you achieve a little bit and you are satisfied comparing yourself now to what you was a year before, you automatically fail. You don't close your business and go. Thank you for watching us. Guys, we really love you guys. I really talk with my heart. Everything I say, guys, is happened to me. And I know that there's a lot of people with a lot of dreams and with a lot of vision. And the only way to make it work is for you to identify the people that can take you there. You cannot do it alone. Let's go. Victor Galvan, remember my name. All right, guys. Thank you so much for joining us on another episode of 24-7 Mindset, guys. You heard it here first. Got to get in the room. Thank you for listening, guys. Thank you for all the followers. Thank you for all the likes, guys. Please continue to punch that button over and over again, guys. We really do appreciate it, and we'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you.